comments from the our users and I, I read each of them and I respond actually so you will find my response if you have any kind of uh, you know uh, use case or problems you can ask or you can comment here I will try to uh, create a video on that that's what I do okay thank you guys so now jump into the action now uh, I did some research on that PHP my admin topic okay so before we start I we need to configure the PHP my admin so I have uh, installed the XAMPP server and here my Apache and MySQL is started and here is my PHP my admin and I have one employee table here and it is having four records so the objective is uh, to read this data from PHP my admin MySQL to Power BI desktop that's the goal okay let's try to do this okay so that was a question it okay so we are there now and we have MySQL database here and connect okay so I'm repeating the same thing dot zero dot zero dot and test okay now this time it should ask me the question but it's not asking me the question what is the issue okay Okay, it's it's not asking the question on I think once you have okay this is one of another issue I am facing actually once you have configured your credentials it is storing somewhere I need to figure out that for now we'll go to the advanced settings here go to edit and uh, we'll have data source clear permissions delete okay I'm going to clear all the permissions okay okay so I have cleared the permissions now it is asking me again the question uh, the permissions so uh, also we have covered that issue with the password was not prompting okay so now uh, you know how to do that go to your edit and uh, permission settings okay now this should be your screen actually once uh, when you try to connect first time with MySQL so in that case uh, we'll have root as username and password basically we don't have password okay so let's understand that this way so once you create this uh, XAMPP it will not configure any kind of password it will have plain root account that you will find here in PHP my admin go to this config page and you will find here the username as root and there is no password so password is blank basically so you have to keep your password empty straightforward simple easy keep your password empty straightforward simple easy keep your password empty select database uh, write down root user or whatever uh, username you have and uh, go and select this uh, DB and simply click on connect it will ask encryption support say yes boom we are connected four rows are there okay and let's use these rows and show the table okay it's loaded let's see in table mode yeah yep all good 